Okay, so here's what we have. This is a set of bra, a corset top, a little slip dress, some little tiny temporary tattoos I'm going to put on my face to do makeup looks, a little cardigan thingy that's got a lot of boob going on, a little if it's meant to be, it'll be type dress, um, a set, a set, and some fucking bitching, bitching shoes. Right. Comes out to four sixty three. Overnight shipping. Do I feel better now? Of course I do. Sure. I mean, it had to be done. I, I couldn't get it out of my system until I got it out of my system. I, I've been sitting here for at least three hours doing this. Like, apparently that's not part of my addiction. It's just my personality. Was any of that necessary? No. I obviously haven't even been making videos. <laughs> She calls me day and night I'm sorry girl, you just don't make me feel right I never meant to make you cry, you were right Just leave me be, I'm not gonna put up a fight Every time you wake up feeling worse than you Alright, let's see what Want to make a return, baby? Uh, probably fucking not, because you guys don't even offer returns, so what are you talking about? Let's see. Item number one. So cute. Item number two. Should have been sa saving the Sugar Thrills bags from the start. But I haven't been. I've been throwing them away. I think I'll start saving them now. But I have saved every single Sugar, Th Sugar Thrills tag that's always attached by a safety pin. So I can safety pin it back on. I have a ginormous bag of them upstairs. This is the top that I got strictly because it was on sale for like 50% off it's uh it was like $19 when originally it was like a lot more I think it was actually 60% off it feels weird and it's glittery though I mean it's not we'll see how it looks on I mean it's it's fine item number three again sugar thrills and I guess this is the reason that I didn't save all the bags because some of them are not easy to just open you have to rip them so like what's the point of being a rip that's that right I guess that wasn't that drastic, but whatever. And wouldn't you know it, the day after I bought this shit, most of it went on sale for 50% off. <laughs> it's like they do it to me every fucking time, you know? But whatever, I'm not complaining. It doesn't matter. Want to know why? Because you can't complain when it comes to Dolls Kill. Because you're, no matter what, wrong. But yeah, Sugar Thrills, if you didn't know by now, I'm completely obsessed. One of these days I'll do shit maybe even today if i'm feeling froggy i'll do an entire sugar thrills collection try on video item number four couldn't actually tell you what this is it's just a it's the, my little ribbed black cropped biker shorts sweat set and this is a brand I've never seen before, or at least never ordered before from there. Okay. Next item. I stopped counting. Uh, I'm trying to guess, like, what they are. Like, see if I can remember. Like, bitch, did you really need that? Like, do you even know what you ordered um, before I open it? Like, hmm, what was this? I 
think this is the wrenched short, I mean, wrenched shirt and short set. I have no idea. We'll see. Yes, it was. And I got this because, okay, I saw it on the site and I was like, oh, cute. And it's, it comes in a few different colors and I might have to, after I try it on, buy it in all of the different colors. But I saw Trisha Paytas wearing this. Even though you could barely see it, I knew what she was wearing and where she got it um, because I had seen it on the site. I saw her wearing this, I think it was in pink on the um, Frenemies podcast. And, uh, and that's when it was like, okay, confirmed, I need it for sure now. And this is from a very strange brand that was probably, I mean, look, judging by the packaging and I wouldn't be at all surprised and the label, I wouldn't be at all surprised if this was marked up to 30 something dollars from about 12. I mean, it seems like it's okay material, but at the same time, this mixed with this tells me, and I'm sure that we'll look it up together. This is a an Ally Express type of gig, okay? But you know, I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it. Um, well, I'll put you up on some game. I went ahead and saw some of the lingerie that I liked. I looked at who made it. And once I found out and noticed that they are a wholesale distributor, such as Roma Costumes and uh, Mapel, for instance, um, there's a few other ones that I can't think of off the top of my head. I went ahead and, and ca like went to the California State Registry, you know, business, whatever website, and I signed up for, it's free, you sign up for like a little business wholesale license thing. If you're a sole proprietor, it's free. You get it done in like about 10 minutes as long as like it's between the hours of 8 a.m. and 5 p.m. or something like that. And then you go to those websites of the wholesale distributor like Mapel and Rama Confidential and I mean, it has to be like an order of like $150 at a time, but you get the lingerie for like half of the price that they are selling it for on Bell's Kill. So I can't, or the Hustler store. They also work with those brands um, very often. Very cute stuff. And I can't bring, so therefore I can't bring myself to buying any of it from the Hustler store, like or Dolls Kill, whenever I walk in the hustler store, I'm like, mm, mm, but I have a wholesale license and I'm not buying that shit for 40 bucks. No, thank you. I'll go on home and order a whole fucking shit ton of it for <laughs> half the price that you guys are gouging me for. So like, yeah, you know, I'm just like, mm. but literally little does everybody in the store know anybody can fucking do that. Any, literally anybody. You just go to their website, fill out their application, send them a copy of the business it's not, it's like a business license. It has like a number on it and everything, at least in California. You send them a copy of that shit that you just got off of the state website for fucking free that took you about 10 minutes and they approve your account in a couple days and then you get to just order willy nilly. So there you go. Fun fact. You're welcome. Don't say I never did anything for you because I've done a fucking bunch for you. Okay, let's not get started. Next item. This is going to be the little slip dress. So it's precious. 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 It's just a thin piece of satin, honestly, with like a little lace up back and some eyelet lace. But it's cute. I mean, I don't want to bother making it. It's got some nice embroidery detail on the front. Whatever. Whatevs. It's cute. Next item. I like it. I think it's cute. How's it going to look on? I don't know, but at least I ordered a small this time because Sugar Thrills dresses, for some reason, I swim in them. Let's see the next thing I got. And then there's one more package after this. What is this? Oh, it's a bra. Cute. Cute. There's two more things. All oh, these are gonna be fun. Hold on. So these are little temporary tattoos, but they're tiny. So my thought was like, do makeup with them? Maybe. Okay, last item. Yeah, no, I just had to have these fucking shoes, and then the next day, the wedge version went on sale, and I'm still contemplating buying them, because they're so fucking adorable. Oh. My. God. 
they were $120, bitch. Oh my goodness. Wait, wait, the best part. There's all the little buckles and stuff, you see? They're super fucking cute. That's it. Okay. I'll try this some of this stuff on the stuff that's not too risque. And we'll see how it turns out. And if you like this video, don't forget to drop a like. Leave a comment, tell me what's your favorite piece. Leave a comment, tell me how I shouldn't be buying from Dolls Kill because they're canceled. Because at least you're engaging. And don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you can be the first to live the whole life. And live vicariously through me and these shopping ventures. You're welcome. Again. Desperately need new lashes, but this is the first little outfit from a terrible angle because I just want to use this mirror and I haven't hung it up. It's it's cute or whatever. And I can't show you this cute little bra, but it only comes in size small, medium, or large, so it's like kind of hard to judge. But I'm part of the itty bitty titty committee now, so like you know it works. Um, but it's too sheer to show you. Don't mind my. Terrible angles, it's cute, and and you can make them longer, and you can make them shorter, longer, shorter. Sorry for the terrible fucking angles. Outfit number two. Nala's whining because she doesn't want to eat her dinner. Imagine. But it's cute and stuff. It's kind of itchy, like weird material, whatever. I'll go to the bigger mirror. Come on now. I don't really know how to feel about this one. At all. How do you feel about it? Do you feel about it? Yes, I'm still wearing the shorts underneath because, like, just pretend they're not there. What? What the fuck? What the fuck did I do? Why did it? What? Where? Huh? When? Hmm. Nice. I don't. Mm. I had to take the shorts off for this one because, like, this is so fucking cute. I think I'm wearing this for the rest of my life. Bury me in this. It is the fucking most adorable thing I've ever seen. Um, uh, besides the bra. But you know what? I don't even think I need a bra with this. But we'll see. But I probably do. I probably should. Indecent exposure is a thing. But, like, fucking literally. The cutest cut. The cutest... <sighs> I knew it was going to be adorable when I saw it, and I was right. This is pretty fucking adorbs, too. I was just struggling for a moment to get this on, and then I was like, it dawned on me, like, after I was like, <laughs> like, trying to tuck my ribs in and, and, you know, not breathe and shit, like, I mean, I zipped it, like, conquered, but it, it has a tie, baby. It's not that serious. It's okay. You're gonna be fucking fine. I can't believe this one on sale for $19. Like, this is adorable. Love it. Another fucking fine purchase. See, this is my point. Like, never in my life will I ever walk in these. There's no fucking way. But I had to have them. They're still pretty, though. Fucking gorgeous.